Dear subscribers of Andrandrulapam, we greet you in the precious name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Daily meditation for Thursday, the 7th of September 2023. The topic for the day is call to suffer. But when you do good and suffer, if you take it patiently, this is commendable before God for to this you were called 1 peter chapter 2 verses 20 and 21 god has called us unto holiness unto peace unto eternal glory he has also called us to suffer for his name's sake and to patiently bear the same because christ has also suffered for us leaving us an example that you should follow his steps it is a blessed privilege to suffer for the sake of christ consider the great sufferings and pains that our lord endured for our sake we cannot even imagine the excruciating pain when his hands and feet were pierced with nails it is only because of the great love that he had for us that he patiently endured all that pain and suffering in those days when paul and silas were beaten and thrown into prison they realized that they were called to patiently endure the suffering they deemed it as a blessed privilege to suffer for the lord that is why they were unmindful of their bodily pains and spent the whole night in praising and worshiping the lord their acceptance of the call to suffer was the secret of such joyful singing in their prison cell amidst all their sufferings apostle paul writes now if we are afflicted it is for your consolation and salvation which is effective for enduring the same sufferings which we also suffer or if we are comforted it is for your consolation and salvation and our hope for you is steadfast because we know that as you are partakers of the sufferings so also you will partake of the consolation 2 corinthians chapter 1 verses 6 and 7 search the scripture and find out about how each disciple had to meet their life's end apostle peter was crucified upside down on the cross mark the author of one of the gospels was tied to a chariot and was dragged till death in rome matthew died as a martyr in ethiopia Apostle Thomas died as a martyr in India. James was beheaded. Apostle John was thrown into heated oil. But none of these could separate them from the love of God. It is because they completely understood and recognized their calling. The scripture says, and if children then has has of god and joined has with christ if indeed we suffer with him that we may also be glorified together for i consider that the sufferings of this present time are not worthy to be compared with the glory which shall be revealed in us romans chapter 8 verses 17 and 18 children of god Do not be wearied in your soul when you have to go through sufferings never depart from the love of Christ at the time of suffering the lord will grant you the grace bear you up and guide you verse for further meditation for i will show him how many things he must suffer for my name's sake acts chapter 9 verse 16 today's bible reading 
in the morning proverbs chapters 1 and 2 in the evening 1 corinthians chapter 